Picture this, a vast savanna teeming with zebras, giraffes, and elephants. Lions roar in the distance while monkeys swing through lush canopies. But wait, something's missing. Where are the bears? Africa, despite its incredible biodiversity, is strangely devoid of these furry behemoths. This essay will delve into this earth sign mystery, exploring why bears, despite once roaming Africa, are now absent from the continent. Join us as we uncover the fascinating history of bears in Africa and the factors that led to their disappearance. To understand why there are no bears in Africa today, we must journey back in time to an era when the continent was home to a variety of incredible creatures. Millions of years ago, a formidable bear species called Agriotherium roamed parts of Africa, Asia, and Europe. This ancient bear was a true giant of its time. These ancient bears were no teddy bears. They were apex predators, built for power and size, dominating their habitats with their sheer strength and hunting prowess. Imagine a bear larger than a grizzly with a bone-crushing bite and an appetite for meat. Agriotherium was a fearsome predator, capable of taking down large prey with ease. That's Agriotherium in a nutshell. This bear was a master of its environment, adapting to various landscapes and climates. Fossil evidence tells us that Agriotherium thrived in Africa for millions of years. These fossils provide crucial insights into the bear's anatomy, diet, and behavior. Their presence adds a fascinating layer to our understanding of Africa's prehistoric ecosystem. They coexisted with other ancient animals, contributing to a complex and dynamic environment. But as with many ancient creatures, their reign eventually came to an end. The reasons for their extinction remain a topic of scientific investigation, but their legacy lives on in the fossil record. During their heyday, Agriotherium shared the African landscape with a menagerie of incredible creatures. Giant crocodiles lurked in the waterways, saber-toothed cats stalked their prey, and early hominids were just beginning their evolutionary journey. Life for Agriotherium was a constant struggle for survival, a delicate dance between predator and prey. They competed for food and territory, their lives intertwined in the complex web of life that characterized prehistoric Africa. But as the climate began to change, the balance of power shifted, and Agriotherium, along with many other species, faced an uncertain future. As the Earth's climate fluctuated, Africa experienced dramatic transformations. Lush forests gave way to open grasslands, and water sources dwindled. These changes had a profound impact on the continent's flora and fauna. Animals that couldn't adapt to the new conditions faced extinction. Agriotherium, once a dominant predator, found itself struggling to survive in a changing world. Their preferred prey became scarce and competition for resources intensified. The changing climate was a recipe for disaster, pushing Agriotherium and many other species towards the brink. Section 5, The Human Factor, A Hastened Farewell While climate change played a significant role in the decline of Agriotherium, it wasn't the only factor. Another significant factor likely contributed to their demise, the rise of humans who were becoming more adept at survival. As early humans spread across the globe, they began to inhabit new territories and ecosystems. They competed with large predators for food and resources, often coming into direct conflict with these formidable creatures. Our ancestors were skilled hunters, using sophisticated tools and strategies to hunt. They were capable of taking down even the largest animals, including the mighty Agriotherium. This intense competition, coupled with the pressures of a rapidly changing climate, proved to be too much for Agriotherium to bear. Their numbers dwindled as they struggled to adapt. Their reign in Africa, which had lasted for millennia, came to an abrupt end leaving behind only fossils as a testament to their once dominant existence, a silent reminder of a bygone era. Section 6. The Fragile Balance, Nature's Intricate Web The extinction of Agriotherium, a prehistoric bear species, serves as a stark reminder of the delicate balance that exists within nature. This ancient creature once roamed vast landscapes, playing a crucial role in its ecosystem, Changes in climate, habitat loss, and competition for dwindling resources can have devastating consequences for entire species. As the environment shifts, the survival of many creatures hangs in the balance, often leading to tragic outcomes. This scenario highlights the interconnectedness of all living things and underscores the importance of preserving biodiversity. Every species, no matter how small, plays a vital role in maintaining the health of our planet's ecosystems. The story of Agriotherium is not unique. Throughout history, many species have faced similar fates, disappearing forever from the face of the Earth. Countless species have vanished from our planet throughout history, each extinction a loss for the intricate web of life. 
These losses serve as poignant reminders of the fragility of our natural world. It is up to us, as stewards of this planet, to learn from the past and protect the remaining biodiversity for future generations. By understanding the causes of past extinctions, we can take proactive steps to ensure the survival of the species that still share our world. Section 7, Bears in Africa Today, a look at Atlas Bears. While true bears are absent from Africa today, there's a fascinating footnote to the story, the Atlas Bear. This subspecies of brown bear once roamed the Atlas Mountains of North Africa. Sadly, they were hunted to extinction in the late 19th century, marking the final chapter of bears in Africa. The demise of the Atlas Bear serves as a poignant reminder of the impact human activities can have on vulnerable species. It underscores the need for conservation efforts to protect endangered animals and their habitats. Section 8. Conclusion. A world without African bears. So why are there no bears in Africa today? The answer lies in a complex interplay of factors, including climate change, competition, and human activities. The extinction of Agriotherium and the Atlas Bear highlights the fragility of ecosystems and the importance of preserving biodiversity. As we marvel at the incredible diversity of African wildlife, let us remember the ghosts of bears past and strive to create a future where all species, no matter how large or small, can thrive on our planet.